3D tool compensation is not something that is specific to 5-axis machining, but it does become more useful in 5-axis machining. What 3D tool compensation does is not only allow for the program to compensate for the radius of the tool in the diameter direction, but it will also allow for compensation of the tool nose radius. More evident in something like a bull nose. You may have a half inch diameter tool with a thirty thousandths radius on the corner. Let's say that either for wear, you can adjust for wear this way, or let's say we broke that tool. We're running a third shift on a Friday night. Uh, that tool is broken. There are no more tools in the shop, but we do have some regrind tools that have not only a different diameter, but a different radius on the edge of that bullnose. By simply changing some registers in the control that one for the radius, which is typical that most people are familiar with, but also one for the corner radius, uh, the operator is able to then substitute without any program changes that new tool and the program will then utilize that table of radius compensation and tool nose radius compensation to adjust for this different size tool.